2015 Hancock Invitational with the uh, the uh, Fatima duo of Anna Massman on the left there and Brianna Holler on the right and the Brianna's sophomore and Anna's junior and the Fatima Comets are two-time defending class uh, class two champions and um, ladies, what what tell me about uh, the race today? What was the plan and uh, Whatever it was, it worked out pretty good with a 1-2 finish, about 1917 and 1927, I think. Yeah, it's more of that, like, what we use is that we always try to help each other and push ourselves with our teammates. Sure. To stick with them, and that means finish 1-4, through four, so it was always nice, and it did work out. But, yeah, it always helps us to push harder, to stick with them, and do better for our team. Yeah, yeah. Our original plan was to start out at about a 6.05 pace. Okay and then gradually keep that pace or accelerate. Okay. And did that, did that seem to work out, I guess? All right? It's been working out for yeah. the last couple of races. Okay. It's all, I mean, you want to try different things, too. But, yeah, it seems to be working out pretty good. To well, you can't get much better than 22 that. points and uh, one through four and a little bit better than that. I mean, that's impressive. Tell me about that. Um, it's nice knowing that. We've got a great team in that we can like depend on them to pull out and pull through. Sure. We always have each other's backs, literally. <laughs> yeah, and uh, tell me what it's been like uh, uh, winning the uh, state titles the last two years. Um, that's nice. I mean, <laughs> going from being Fatima School from Rosalia, not many people have heard of, heard of us, and then we gone and shown us what we can do and shown us who Fatima High School is. <laughs> sure, sure. And being a freshman in Wynn State and being a state champion on team member, that's pretty amazing. Yeah, that was pretty exciting for me. <laughs> yeah. But I couldn't have done it without the team. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I bet you could have. <laughs> well, yeah. have you guys talked about team goals? Is the goal the goal to win again or, or have you guys, well, do you guys stay away from talking about yeah, that? Or do you yeah, talk Mr. Bridges is our coach has been telling us this year that we're supposed to think in the present, not about anything yeah. in the past, not about anything in the future. Okay. It's just this moment right here. <laughs> but I'm pretty sure that's the ultimate goal is to win state again. Sure. Sure. Do you feel like you guys are on the right path to doing that? You look like it, look like it after today. It's hard to say for now, but, um, I mean, we'll always work to try our hardest and see and try to do the best we can do. Yeah. Yeah, and obviously being a... At least having a big meet that you've got a lot of teams from a bunch of different areas uh, here today. Uh, big, big accomplishment with the one-two finish. What did you feel like crossing that line? Tired. <laughs> I feel like I'm glad this is over. Yeah. yeah, it was. It was nice to go through and then, like I said, turn back and see the rest of my team coming through. Yeah, it was a good feeling seeing us come in first, second, third, and fourth. Yeah, that's quite an accomplishment. Uh, that doesn't happen too often. Um, well, what's next on the schedule? Have you guys got a uh, conference coming up, or what's next for you? Uh -huh, we yeah. have a conference meet on Tuesday mm -hmm. at okay. Lynn. And then uh, a couple more weeks, and then uh, districts and sectionals. And you let yourself think about what it would be like to be back up on that stadium, on that podium again at state, or, or are you doing like Coach says and staying in the moment? It's hard not to think about it, but, yeah, I'm trying not to worry about what's ahead of me. Yeah. <laughs> You know, yeah. not let that intimidate or give us any bigger uh, visions than we can. Sure. Uh, yeah, I'm trying to stay in the present, but then it was a really good feeling last year being up there and have everybody screaming Fatima. Yeah, yeah. And Anna, what's it like? You said you didn't have the, quite the state meet that you wanted last year, um, um, but you're having a great season this year and beating your teammate who's the state champion. So what's that feel like? Oh, uh, well... It's just last year. Um, I last year was really helpful to me. I, it was a bad. It wasn't quite what I wanted to do, but I know that it could helps a lot more than if I would have done any better than I did. Because I mean, it's really the situations that are bad that help you to be a better runner. Sure, sure. So, what's it feel like bouncing back this year and uh, and beating your teammate, the state champion? Oh gosh, that's not in my mind. If she would beat me, that'd be awesome. Okay. I'm just glad to be back and helping my team again. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I'm glad you're there because you helped me stay on pace, push pace, <laughs> help right. those people to get off the course. <laughs> <laughs> right, right. That can happen sometimes. Yeah, well. they were walking across here. Well, thanks for the time, ladies. Congratulations. Keep it up. Stay healthy, and uh, hope we'll see you at state. 
Thank you. Thank you. All right. Thanks.